Peppa meets Father Christmas. It was almost Christmas. Peppa was wrapped up in her warm winter clothes and on her way to playgroup. I can wait for Christmas day, cried Peppa and she and George jumped up and down in the snow. Has everyone got their costume for the Christmas play? asked Madam Gizal. Once everyone had arrived, Peppa and her friends all had parts to practice for the play. Hooray! Ho ho ho! Barked Danny Dog. Danny was Father Christmas. I'm the Christmas fairy, said Peppa, dancing around proudly. I am the Christmas nurse, said Susie. In case anybody gets ill, the next day, Papa, George, Mummy, and Daddy Big went to the supermarket to do some Christmas shopping. Daddy, look, whispered Papa, pointing. It's Father Christmas. Why don't you go over and say hello, said Daddy Pig. Hello, Father Christmas, said Papa, shying. It's me, Papa. Hello, Papa, Father Christmas replied. Are you looking forward to Christmas? Oh yes, said Peppa. We are doing a Christmas play at Playgroup. I am the Christmas fairy and Danny is you. How lovely, said Father Christmas. Ho, ho, ho. I should be Father Christmas really, said Peppa. But Danny is good at ho, ho, ho. Ho oh, ho oh, oh, ho! laughed Father Christmas. Will you come and see our play? asked Peppa. Pleased. <laughs> I am rather busy, Father Christmas replied, but I'll do my best. At playgroup the next day, Peppa and her friends put up the Christmas tree. I saw Father Christmas at the supermarket, cried Peppa. He's coming to see our play. I saw him at the garden center and he didn't tell me that, said Rebecca Rabbit. I saw Father Christmas in the shopping center, said Molly Mole. How can he be in so many places? Father Christmas moves very quickly, said Danny Dog. He gives presents to children all around the world in just one night. On his magic sleigh? added Zoe Zebra, putting the last decoration on the tree. The next morning, Peppa saw Father Christmas at the Christmas tree shop. Hello again, Father Christmas, cried Peppa. Are you still coming to our play? Play? asked Father Christmas. Our Christmas play, said Peppa. You haven't forgotten? Oh, yes, of course, I'll do my best to come, replied Father Christmas. The day of the Christmas play arrived. We can't start yet, whispered Peppa. Father Christmas isn't here. But your parents are waiting, whispered Madame Gazelle. The show must go on. The snowflakes started the play with the song. Snow, snow, it's what we like. Snow by the day. And the snow by the night, and when it falls, it turns things white. Snow, snow, snow. I am the Christmas fairy, said Peppa, jumping on a stage. And I am Father Christmas, said Danny Dog, joining her. Ho, 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 ho. Wonderful, said a voice. It sounds just like... Father Christmas, gasped the children. You are here? Oh, oh, oh. You came to see our play after all, cried Peppa. Of course, I did, Peppa, said Father Christmas. It's very good. Do you really go all around the world in one night? asked Wendy Wolf. Yes, replied Father Christmas. 
Big Boy, Magic Slay and Reindeer. Please, can we see your sleigh? Asked Petro Pony. <laughs> I am sure Father Christmas is a bit too busy to show us his sleigh, said Madam Gazelle. It's true, I am very busy, but of course you can see my sleigh, said Father Christmas. Come outside, everyone. Father Christmas led the children, their families and Madam Gazelle outside. Wow! Everyone gasped, seeing his golden sleigh sparkling in the snow. It's beautiful, cried Peppa. What is it like to ride in? Hop in and I'll show you, replied Father Christmas. Moo! cried the children as the Father Christmas flew them across the sky. Ho, 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 laughed Father Christmas. Happy Christmas, everyone! Ho, ho, ho! This is the best Christmas ever, cheered Peppa. Thank you, Father Christmas. Merry Christmas! The end. If you like my story, please like and subscribe our channel.